Hi, I'm Dr. Karin Power, and as a preventative medicine and anti-aging specialist, I'm always interested in ways to help people feel better and live healthier lives. Recently, there's been a lot of attention on the media stations regarding testosterone therapy as a preventative medicine tool. Some of the early symptoms that I hear about are fatigue, poor sleep, aches and pains, and a general sense of malaise. People frequently think about the sexual symptoms of low testosterone, but in fact that can be a later manifestation. So during the first visit, I will go over the symptoms and the questionnaires and find out what's really bothering the man. Typically, once a man has lost about half of his peak testosterone level, he becomes symptomatic. So often men have come to me, they have already seen a primary care physician who's told them that their testosterone level is normal but they're still suffering from the symptoms of low testosterone. Again, this is due to the fact that the man may have started off at a higher level and now he's reached half of his peak level. Once I have determined a man's symptoms and his testosterone levels by laboratory, I do a physical exam and we have a long discussion about the risks and benefits of testosterone therapy. Studies do demonstrate that testosterone therapy brings down cholesterol levels, it improves blood sugar control, and therefore prevents and even treats metabolic syndrome and early diabetes. Studies have also shown that men with the lowest testosterone have the highest mortality due to cancer death and cardiovascular risk. There are also great benefits as far as generalized preventative care. Almost 100% of my male patients have experienced a decline in their overall cholesterol values. So testosterone therapy can have benefits in, in generalized health and can be a strong or, or powerful preventative medical tool, as well as very much improving um, the quality of a man's life.